Hey everybody, welcome to The Real Show Barbecue. Today we're doing a cook in the Orion cooker and do a little bit of a review. Up here in the iCard, you'll check out uh, the video I did when we put it together and kind of did a little walkthrough on it. And we're going to be cooking an eight pound pork butt. Come on in a little closer and I'll show you. Uh, we use this incredible, the uh, by Heaven Made Products and their amazing Cajun. These two combinations together, I've done it on a, uh, some pork pork before, it was amazing together. And since we were coming out here camping, I went ahead and prepped it a couple of days ago, a little olive oil to a layer of each. Just wrapped it up in some plastic and aluminum foil and left it in the cooler until we got here today. And we're gonna go ahead and get this thing on the cooker and get rolling. So let's go ahead and take a look at the cooker right quick. If you can see in here, I've taken the shavings, uh, the, the wood shavings basically uh, from Orion Cooker. This is their boldness medium, which is good for pork. And I put it in here around the drip pan, and I'm gonna put a little bit of water in this drip pan. You won't have to put a whole lot because it, it keeps a lot of the, 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 the moisture inside. So it's gonna be a lot of the grease and so forth is gonna stay in here. And then what we've got around on the outside is you put charcoal around on the outside, and then you also put a little bit of charcoal on, on the top. And we're gonna like that. So let's go ahead and get started on that real quick. All right, we're gonna put this in the second layer, the groove rate in the second layer. You got a layer at the bottom, second layer, and a layer here at the top that you can, to put different grates. Right here in the middle. We're gonna go ahead and light this charcoal. All right, since we got the cooker lit, it says that we should be able just to kind of set it and forget it. It's very windy out here today, so I'm going to kind of come back maybe around three, three and a half hours, check the charcoal. We may have to put a little bit more on it just to finish the cook. But stick with us. We're going to check it out, see where we're at. We've been going three and a half hours total on this. We'll check this with our instant read Maverick. We're good over here on this side. We're looking at about 200. Yeah. That's 195. We're going to take this now and we're going to wrap it in some foil and let it sit for a while in a cooler. Now right, we're gonna wrap this guys, we're gonna double pull it. It's already falling apart on us here. We're gonna wrap it in a towel and put it in the cooler. All right, here we go. The bone came out clean. That's exactly what you want. We're gonna take and kind of pull this apart using our premiella. These are some awesome claws. To kind of pull it apart here. Yep. Looks good. We're gonna do us a taste test in just a minute. Pour a little bit of this. I'm gonna strip it some more, but we're gonna use this barbecue sauce right here I made. There'll be a link to the uh, on the iCard to this recipe if y'all want to try it out. Pour a little bit on there, and we'll stir it up some more, and we'll give this a taste. All right, as far as what I think of the cooker, it did great. Um, it said exactly what it's going to do. It took about three and a half hours to do an eight pound 
uh, Boston butt or pork, uh, pork butt, and it was super juicy, super moist. I took it, wrapped it up, like I said, and it's pulled apart great. It's got a nice bark on there. It took about 10 pounds of charcoal. I had someone wondering about that. 10 pounds of charcoal total, three and a half hours, done. So we're gonna do a taste test. All right, it's time for our taste test. What y'all think? Good, yummy, really good. Yeah. fantastic. <laughs> 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 <laughs>